Hello my wolf and welcome back to another episode of our How To Use a Competitive Guides. I could not think of the word there for a second, and even then I got the wrong word. But you know what, we're going to start off with this video. We're doing Dog Trio today and a Lowland Dog Trio. The Hanson, the Hanson is here. And we're going to start off with this first Dog Trio, which has a Groundium Z as its hold item. Then Sand Force, uh, because that increases 1.3 times on Stone, Steel and Rock type moves. No, Rock, Steel and Ground type moves, sorry. Uh, and then move wise, it has Stealth Rock, Earthquake, Sucker Punch, and Stone Age. So Stealth Rock is obviously to set up yourself. Your rock is very handy in games. It can dwindle down Pokemon, especially if you've got like a Charizard or something, or like a Bug Flying type that's going to take down 50% of its health. If you can whirlwind it out or something, that's, do that's gone. That's completely gone. But yeah, we have Earthquake, which is a stab move. Uh, one, 150 base power with the stab taken in. Then we have Sucker Punch, which is priority and can be quite handy. And then Stone Age just to hit a couple of more mons, basically. And then EV wise we have a fast physical sweeper, so this is max attack, max speed with a jolly nature, so more in speed, less in special attack, because you're not using a special attack at all. And then four in special defense just because they've got four left over, so you can use that. Our second Dug Trio is a bit of a different one, this is more of a kind of gimmicky set. You can't use this in OU because Arena Trap is now banned, but leftovers, Arena Trap. Toxic, Protect, Rest, and Earthquake. Basically, you Toxic them on, you Protect, you Rest, you <laughs> to Rest and Protect to try and get that Toxic up. Earthquake, if you can, and then you have Max HP, Max Special Defense. So you don't really want to be doing this against defensive, against physical attackers. You want to be doing this against special attackers more. Uh, admittedly, your HP isn't too high, but you can give this a go. You can give it as much of a go as you want. And then you have 4 in attack for that Earthquake. And the careful nature, so you want more in special defense and less in special attack. Going on to Alolan Dog Trio now, we have a Focus Sash. This is one I copied exactly from Smogon. Um, I personally don't think I would use it because I don't quite understand the set fully, but um, this this is what Smogon has suggested to me, so I thought, screw it, I'll take it and we can see. But yeah, it's uh, got a Focus Sash, Tangling Hair, which if it's hit by a physical move, it lowers the mon speed. Then Earthquake and Ironhead are both stab. Memento, it decreases the attack and special attack completely, I think, or by two, by two, which is handy. You faint, unfortunately, but it can be handy to get one or one to fit the switch out or to really demolish that one's attacking power. And then Sucker Punch, obviously, is the priority again, and running the exact same as the first Dug Trio there, the Fast Physical Sweeper. And then our last Dug Trio today we have is... Again, another gimmicky one, we have Leftovers, Sand Veil, which is for the evasion, it's handy to have a Sandstorm on with this, say Hippowdon or Tyranitar, they both have Sandstream. And then for this one we have Ancient Power to try and get the Ancient Power boost up, then you have Flash Cannon, Earth Power and Sludge Wave, uh, which are all, all special attacks, but I thought, screw it, you know what, we'll give it a go, we'll give it a go. So this is Max Special Attack and Max Speed with a Timid Nature, so more speed and less attacks, you're not using your attack stat at all. I know it's completely gimmicky and probably wouldn't work in any way, shape, or form, but you know, you can give it a go. Anyways, that's all I have for Dog Trios today, so I hope you enjoyed this. If you have, please do like, subscribe, and comment down below how you use your Dog Trios. Anyways, I'm off, so I'll see you soon.